Alrighty folks, so we are out here on Paris Island. We are about to launch this kayak that my dad got me as an early birthday present for my 25th birthday. Um, so yeah, he did a lot of cool stuff to it. He got it off the Facebook marketplace for a, for a pretty good deal. Mm -hmm. um, it's a pretty expensive kayak. And he spent like an extra, probably, like, probably over $100 on his own modifications and rigging and stuff like that. So we're yep. going to have a great time. He added lots of different um, little modification things here. He added foot pedals for the seats. You can't see them right here, but they're somewhere right there. Foot pedals for the seats. This anchor system. They're about we're about to put on there now. Anchor system. Back seat. Some more little stuff. Yeah, he did a heck of a job with this. And the sun is glowing. <laughs> but we are about to go all the way up there. What's happening to me? In the dark, can you tell me what it means? I lay my head on my pillow. Staring out the Logan is wanting to go all the way out to one of those islands out there, and I'm not doing that today. We are now on the island and it's windy. <laughs> hey! <laughs> oh gosh. Twenty four minutes left, or twenty four minutes later, and we're still out here because both of the ratchet traps are broken. Where you at? I'm looking for the what in the world are you at tonight, huh? I just got this bodysuit. I just got my flesh. Got a little bit of pouch, but we gonna fix that soon. Hey, hey, hey. No, you gotta wait till I do it. Well, that looks a little bit less than masculine for me, so. Come Most on. all I'll do is. How was I just doing? That looks like. That looks. You don't look masculine at all doing that. I don't know. And we're not putting that on YouTube though. Christmas tree thing I was talking about. Tell the saying? camera what happened to your uh, forehead. No, I'm not doing that. 
Why not? It's called scope bite. That usually doesn't happen, but I didn't want to adjust this recruit's rifle because it was already adjusted. The buttstock was already adjusted to where he had to have it. So I was zeroing his rifle for him and the buttstock was too close, but I didn't want to move it for him. So I just went ahead and I stayed there anyway. And it just barely popped me, but just barely is enough to give you that scope bite. That's what that's called. Mm. <laughs> Hey you all, so for this video, I would like to give a huge shout out to Alex T 1054 Thank you so much for all your comments, your love and appreciation, and just continuously being there for our channel and our growth. Um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video so far. I don't know if you can tell, but I am trying to go about a different style of editing. I would love to get more into a cinematic type of vlog scenario. So bear with me as I am learning on my editing journey. And once again, thank you and love you all. Peace.